WTFNN. Headline news update. Welcome, everybody. Tommy O'Brien coming to you live from TFNN headquarters in Clearwater, Florida, 2 p.m. Eastern time, two hours until that closing bell, and one more trading day in 2017. Surprise, surprise, markets relatively higher. Dow Jones positive by 36 points, trading at 24,810. S&P is negative by one point, trading at 2683. NASDAQ positive by three points, trading at 69. 43. So two hours left in the trading day, one more day until that long weekend coming into 2018. Let's check in on some of these futures markets. We're going to start things off with Bitcoin. Quite a volatile day, week, couple weeks for Bitcoin. Currently trading at 13,598. Quite a pullback, just backing up this chart until yesterday. We're up almost at 16,000. That's yesterday morning, 9.30 a.m. on the far left of that chart. That is some volatility. And some of that news coming in because South Korea moving to regulate cryptocurrency trading. South Korea, a big player in the cryptocurrency world. So we're just jumping around. All of these cryptocurrencies taking a quick look. Yeah, Bitcoin down almost 10%. Ethereum down 7%, Bitcoin Cash down almost 12%, Litecoin down almost 13%. So tough, tough day for cryptos. We'll see how the week shakes up. There you go, Bitcoin. We'll see. Crude oil on the other side, getting a little bit of a bid for itself. Crude, we had EIA inventories at 11 a.m. today, coming Thursday instead of Wednesday because of the holiday. Getting there is that 1030 bar, a little bit of a bid almost in line we'll jump over let's get those crude oil numbers there they are so we had headline number crude with a decline of 4.6 barrels a billion million barrels excuse me 4.6 million barrels median estimate was a decline of 3.7 million barrels so not too far off but oil continuing to get a bid closing in on that 60 dollars price point natural gas also doing well we had natural gas inventories coming right in line at 1030 today, 292 on natural gas as most of the country hits with some serious cold, backing it up to just yesterday, quite a number going from about the 260s to 292. Gold holding steady at 1296.55 so far. That's our NASDAQ 100, but the, the indices is declining a little bit, kind of just hanging out near the lows that they've had since that opening decline we saw. s and 2683. Stay tuned, folks. We got Tom O'Brien coming up live from 3 till 5. Wraps up the market day as we come into the final Friday of 2017. Have a great afternoon. Have a great day. We'll talk to you next hour for a top of the hour update at TFNN.com.